Kylie Dawson made the decision to breastfeed her son Noah. Really, the biggest reason was all the benefits for the baby. But many new moms don't factor their own health into their decision and aren't aware that breastfeeding for at least six months greatly reduces their risk for breast cancer. What is the best way to improve mortality from cancer? Prevention. Dr. Bovina Ramaswamy is working to arm women with as much knowledge as possible to make the best decision for themselves and their babies. She led a study at the Ohio State University Comprehensive Cancer Center, James Cancer Hospital, and Solove Research Institute to gauge their knowledge and was glad to learn that nearly 60% of moms surveyed had heard of the link between breastfeeding and cancer risk reduction. Unfortunately, only 16% of those women got that information from a health care provider. Are we making sure that our patients, our mothers, when they come to you as patients, are aware of the benefits of breastfeeding to them before they make their decisions. 60% of women who did not breastfeed said having this knowledge would have influenced their decision. This is particularly important for African American women who are less likely to breastfeed but are much more likely to carry a gene mutation predisposing them to triple negative breast cancer, an aggressive and deadly form of the disease. Even in that cohort of patients, the carriers of that mutation, when they breastfed, prolonged breastfeeding, they reduce the risk of developing triple negative breast cancer by 32 percent. With a family history of breast cancer, Kylie is even more confident in her decision. That's like a huge um, just relief mentally that, oh, I'm doing something that um, will help me be around for my kids. At the Ohio State University Comprehensive Cancer Center, James Cancer Hospital, and Solove Research Institute, this is Barb Consiglio reporting.